ready. We've got a texture hopper. So I'm going to get this thing all assembled, which is not really much. <laughs> Put a clamp uh, right there and th screw in your uh, fitting. And then just select your size. They have different size nozzles. Um, that you can put in the tip of the gun. Uh, we're just using the smallest one that's already in there. I'll just make sure it's tight. We're gonna spray some texture in that bathroom. Pretty exciting. that again. Yeah, fail. Got the phone clamp on. Look at that bad boy. That's the hoppiest hopper I ever seen. The hopper. Alright, so I got done sanding the walls and this is just the, the kind of sanding pad that uh, we have. It's like a real heavy mesh. Um, but it doesn't clog like regular sandpaper, so makes it nice for when you're uh, when you're sanding. Uh, next step I'm going to do before I start spraying is I just got a, a damp uh, wash no, I don't know, wash rag. I'm just going to wipe down the walls and get all that loose uh, fine powder off. That way the uh, mud sticks a little better when you uh, spray it on the wall. It's kind of like flour um, keeps your uh, dough from sticking on the counter. Uh, we don't want that. We want that mud to stick as good as possible. So we're just going to take this and wipe down the walls real good. behind the uh, shower here because this will all be covered up I'm going to my test shot here. That's, that's, that's some good thinking. Let's see what happens. Looks like it's spraying. Holy that smoke. does. Okay. You got to keep on the move apparently. Apparently, yeah. Looks uh, like pancake batter. I'm gonna do the Makes me want pancake batter. Gotta keep on the move. Yeah. Think that'll work. Okay, well, let's start. That looks really good. Don't you think it does? It's amazing that uh, there's so much work and prep that goes into it and the actual spraying of the texture, but makes it actually look good. It takes like five minutes. <laughs> yep. <laughs> but. Then there's much more work of painting and all that stuff afterwards too. So. Trim, you know. Yeah, I'll do the trim and painting. So you did a good job with the uh, trim at our last place. So mm -hmm. I'm just let you do the trim. Yep. All right, and thank you. <laughs> <laughs> all right, I'll show you the toilet in the living room. 
work area. But it's kind of hard to tell on video. Got everything done. Yeah, prime it with water or whatever you need to get it ready. So get it primed and we're gonna swap it over into paint. Start spraying some paint. Woo woo! Paint in the bathroom. We're gonna have this bathroom done really soon. Are you excited? I am very excited. I'm excited too. I'm ready. I'm ready for a done <laughs> bathroom. I'm ready for a room in this place to be done. Yeah. Me too. How quickly you can paint with a sprayer. It's always a big deal because I can always come back later and do that. So, yeah. Alright, do you want me to paint just plain white like with everything else? No, just paint the walls. Okay, because it'll take two seconds to rip that. Just paint the walls. Paint the walls! <laughs> there you go. Um, if you are going to just go back and paint it later, I might as well paint it now. You're making me tired. I'm probably gonna go back and paint it later, so then I guess you can cut, pull it down and. Do you not want to try that whitewash thing that you're talking about? Or do you want to try it? Later? No, we'll just paint it. I think we're just gonna paint it. Okay, it's like you're trying to talk me in and out of his spraying it now. Well, it's gonna be simplest to just do it now since we've already got okay, it. Okay, let's just do it now then. Okay. Now you're not going to try and change my mind now, are you, to wipe wash it? <laughs> okay. Ooh, I wonder who papered that. She did a really good job. Oh, I she must be a paper aficionado. Good thing you're showering right after this. white while I was painting in there. Okay, so I got the shower saw installed and it's a little, uh, that back wall. Um, should have spent some more time leveling it before we proceeded. But uh, typically you would actually have it bare studs. It would mount all this stuff in there uh, and then drywall afterwards. But I didn't read the instructions, so we're just gonna make it work. Figured out, I'll put some trim obviously around the 